What's up, Gemini gang? What's happening? Happy Monday, you guys. Let's check this energy for y'all today. All Gemini placements, take or resonates. Leave the rest. Take it how it resonates with you and your situation. Ah! If you need a personal reading, check the description box, you guys. Okay, you're separated from someone. Lovepeacegenesis.com. Y'all know the drill already. I appreciate y'all for being here. Hit those likes. Hit those likes. Hit those likes. Hit that subscribe. Can y'all believe it's already Libra season? <laughs> so it's a really good time for like, you know, self-care and pampering yourselves and all that good stuff. So, yes. And it's, it's a season of Venus. Okay. I keep seeing this forgiving and learning card. Um, so someone may want your forgiveness. Um, Gemini's. Go ahead and free yourself. So, um, free yourself card comes out and uh, past life relationship is here again. All right. So we have separation here. Time apart from your partners on the horizon or you're already separated. Okay. Hold on. Let me adjust my lighting. There we go. Wedding is here. Mm hmm. Free yourself. So it's time to take back control of your life. Yes. Okay. And I did get heavy like you guys dibble and dabbling in self-care. Okay. Like really, really focus on your self-care for the next month or so. Okay. And then we have past life relationship. You have known each other before. And I may do a monthly read too. I may start incorporating like doing monthly reads. Uh, as well okay so let's see what's going on wow y'all's cards are flipping over quite quickly ace of cups if you're separated baby eight of wands you won't be a little much longer um yeah gemini somebody's coming to scoop you on up um i'm seeing messages of love someone may even mention like you know they want to marry you or they see long term with you um, or something along wow y'all's cards are doing the most um i feel like this could be like something that someone's kind of been holding in for a long time ace of wands another ace so yeah you have something new here and that could just simply be like you know a past person another ace the ace of swords you have something else coming in or it could be a past person coming in as a new energy, okay? Two of Pentacle, somebody spin the block. Definitely these two cards are somebody spin the block, okay? Someone that you could have ended things with, but this is the beginning and the end of this suit. So I feel like, you know, uh, the ending of one thing is could be the beginning of another. So take that how it resonates with you. But yeah, this is like something coming back around. Something from your past coming back around. Page of Cups could be a water sign for some of you. Or something from your past may need to come up so you can clear that energy um, or get closure or whatever it is you need to get from that situation so you can move forward, uh, Gemini's. There we go. We have the Nine of Cups here. Yep. And then we have the moon, the star, and the five of pentacles. So, yeah, I feel like there may be someone here that, of course, always see, oh, yeah. Always see that this person um, isn't in a really good space. It could be mentally, could be financially, could be all, could be all of the above. I'm just not getting, uh, someone feels like you can, like, heal them. Or something about you is very healing because someone struggles a lot in life. Um, even if they don't struggle financially, I feel like they may struggle. Like some aspect of their life is a huge struggle. And it's like they may uh, kind of turn to you to uh, make that right. Or feel like, you know, looking at you in, in sort of a savior kind of way. Like you can save them um, from their misery. <laughs> Child. Um, but I do see you are somebody's... Uh, desire somebody's desire somebody's wish fulfillment i feel like someone is wanting also to like um wanting like this to, this to be a favorable outcome i'm not gonna take any of these but i'm seeing the ace of wands again another ace the seven of cups here um the king of cups could be a scorpio i did say water sign earlier 
uh, Eight of Pentacles, the Death card, and the Four of Cups. So like I said, if something has been feeling kind of stagnant and stuck, I don't feel like um, it's going to be a thing much longer. Gemini's. Yep, the Magician. Love it. King of Pentacles. Now look, this is similar to a reading that I got for you guys, well, that I got for the Collective um with um something here you manifested uh this could also be too like time apart from someone may have helped them or may have helped this connection um if that makes sense so someone may be coming in in a better space or i can't really say yet gemini's for certain again it's gonna be different for all of you anyway you end up meeting somebody else in the midst of you being separated from somebody or kind of disconnected from someone. But I do see like there, there needs to be some type of um, closure from the past that may need to take place uh, before you can move forward, Gemini's. Yeah, baby, the chatty, it's gonna be a cancer. Baby, somebody's coming for you. And when I tell you, and I feel like somebody is really like having to get out of their comfort zone with this. Because I don't feel like, Gemini's, you've made something easy for somebody. Like, <laughs> well, I won't say that, but I feel like you aren't, um, I don't feel like you're as available to this person as you were at one point. Okay, so I feel like someone's like wanting to come in and compromise, kind of meet you halfway. And again, this is something that's outside of this person's element uh, as well. Someone may also have to travel to you too. Yeah, page of wands, child. Six of wands here on the bottom. Could be an ego thing as well. This person may have like an ego problem. Yeah, damn it. I'm good. It don't. It doesn't make sense for this. Y'all, come on. Anyways, the devil is here. Okay, we have the five of swords here on the bottom, but under the devil is the queen of wands. So, baby, when I tell... Now, this is what this is, because that's why when I saw it, I was like, eh. Now, I will say this, Gemini's. This person is insanely attracted to you. The queen of wands or the devil, it can give a little toxic, okay? But it's like someone that's just very very attractive very sexy very um someone's just very very passionate about you okay especially with the devil here with the nine of cups that could be someone that is thinking about physical now the devil and nine of cups can be like someone that may have a, a drinking problem too so look out for that the nine of cups is sticking out here as well so i would be very cautious of this um, because like I said, there could be like some alcohol involved or like the physical, especially with the queen of wands here, like somebody wanting that physical, thinking physically about you a lot, um, could be a fire sign that you're dealing with or a Capricorn, but, uh, yeah, um, especially with the five of swords here, it's like this person wanting to kind of compete for your affections, but this is someone that is, uh, that has such a strong desire for you and their attraction to you is it, it might be a little um, outside of the norm. <laughs> like somebody is really, really attracted to you. And it would make sense too with it being a past life relationship um, and why their desire is, is so strong for you. Um, Gemini's. Now, like I said, I'll be honest that it is very physical okay something about this is very physical like very you know this person wanting like uh the intimacy and things like that so you know yeah you two may also you know could have been very overindulgent you know when you were dealing with each other it could have been like a very passionate physical um connection between you and this person um, now I'm not saying I'm not saying that's all they want, but that is heavily on their mind because their attraction to you is insane. I mean, this person is like y'all, the ace of pentacles. Yeah, we've seen every ace here. We've seen every ace, okay? The hierophant. That's a proposal of some sort for some of you. Or this person's gonna mention marriage, bring up marriage. 
Um, I feel like this person just doesn't want to be separated. Now, if this is a new person, because some of you guys are going to meet a new energy um, outside of this uh, person you're separated from, and that is going to be the person you end up marrying or uh, having long term with. Y'all, what is going on here? The Five of Wands. Yeah. And the levels, I tell you, somebody feels like they're going to have to compete when they make their way back around. For some of you, that's the case, because I do see there's a new energy for some of you, or new energies, plural. <laughs> so, yeah, there's another energy here, especially if you're single, um, Gemini. Now, some of you ain't single. Some of you might be married, and you may have a, a spouse that's wanting to fight for your connection or fight for y'all's uh, marriage, too. So take that how it resonates with you, because this could simply be like um, you might want to separate because you want something new, but they want to keep it, or vice versa. Okay, so I'm seeing someone here like fighting for y'all's connection um, and not like not wanting to lose you to someone else or uh, another situation but yeah with this here i feel like this is you coming together but it could be too like you pulling away from someone may have helped the situation could also be a twin flame too it's like when you try to get away didn't i get a reading for you this before it's like when you try to get away from someone it's like that's when they like start like fighting for you and really showing up um gemini some of you block somebody as well child not the devil again what's really going on here the devil definitely a past life relationship though the temperance this is someone that wants to come together with you but it's it's an obsession like someone has someone is obsessed with you but i the, the temperance with the devil also gives <clears throat> just like the temperance with the lovers gives twin flame vibes soul tie vibes like you might be soul tied to someone or it just feels like that someone may also have a hard time with balance um, and a hard time with boundaries so keep that in mind okay um when dealing with this person or whatever but i am going to get another one for this for these two devils here actually let me get another another deck but somebody watches you and spies on you i mean it's like you you take up a huge chunk of this person's day um you take up a huge chunk of this person's night because this person thinks about you constantly stalks you they want to know what you're doing they can't understand why the attraction is, is so uh is so strong i'm seeing the full card it didn't flip all the way over though but Ooh, the fool and the devil child. Mm -mm. <laughs> yeah, yeah, see? Now, I've said in other readings to me that the temperance card is like the two of cups 2.0. Like, it's just like an elevated two of cups. So, it's like you are a twin flame to someone or a soul tie to someone. Soulmate, whatever. Ten of wands here. And that's why you two feel so strongly for each other. And this is this person's desire um, has only grown in the separation whereas you think they may have lost interest you think they may have um you know they're they're not as interested as they were that's simply not true okay but i also get to some of you may meet more than one uh, soulmate or someone that you have a very strong uh connection to so you know keep that in mind because i don't feel like this person is the person on your mind is the only energy here. And I feel like there could be another energy. But there is one energy that their attraction to you is insane. Their desire for you is insane. Um, but it could be, like I said, something spiritual. Or you have a past life relationship with this person. It says you have known each other before. And with the devil, the devil can give um, twin flame, karmic type of... Um, situation soul tie because in obviously in the photo it's they're tied together like you know they're literally chained together uh in the photo so it's like it, it gives soul tie you know things like that so yeah gemini's but i do feel like you have somebody here that's that's gonna fight for this fight for you 
um, some of you are already married to this person and you want out <laughs> um, but they don't like they you know and again someone is, is kind of expecting competition or expecting somebody to kind of be in their way and I feel like they'll do whatever to get uh, get whoever out of their way okay I also see drinking as a part of it so it could be you know some type of drunken um, call or whatever I fell for you very quickly yeah they fell for you quickly because of the connection that y'all have it's kind of scary <laughs> I can't sleep I can't eat or sleep without you which makes sense and I told you you you're the first person on this person's mind when they wake up and when they go to sleep that's if they sleep at all okay this ain't over we're on a break I'm telling you this they have some type of possession or whatever uh, on you it doesn't matter how long it's been uh, Gemini's they have some type you have some type of hold on this person 999 hurting you only hurt myself it's because y'all are connected so the pain you feel Gemini they also feel it I'm obsessed with you oh my gosh where's my hands come through spirit clap on my damn self I don't want things to end I'm telling you this person is obsessed and if you block them for whatever reason, baby, you definitely got to get their reaction. Um, child. <laughs> Can we leave the past in the past? Yeah. So that could also be the Ace of Cups, like someone wanting to start fresh, wanting a new beginning, something significant about tomorrow, okay? Or whatever that is. Will you ever take me back? Yeah. Mm-hmm. I fell for you very quickly again y'all we're seeing that again five 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 yes 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 I'm jealous I want you to myself I'm telling you this person has some type of possessiveness over you um and they know that you're attractive and they know other people are going to be checking for you too so you know they don't want anyone else to be able to to come in and and have you in a nutshell uh, Gemini's despite how they may be acting the distance between us is killing me I just think they have a really good poker face because whoever this is stalks you and watches you like a hawk pray for me by Anthony Hamilton <laughs> secret crush I told you you may not even know how much this person is obsessed or spies on you <clears throat> you may be completely oblivious to it you mean so much to me because they keep a good po uh, poker face. Like I said, I'm about to call slash text you. Told you. I told ya. Manifest from the heart. And then I'm going to get whatever this is under here. I'll be back. I told you. Now, let's see what we're going to do about this uh, song shuffle. Oh, you know what? I'm going to shuffle from this old school playlist. And I'm going to see if y'all make y'all do a little homework. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to shuffle from this old school playlist. Um, and this is like 70s, 80s music. So, yeah, if you don't know the song, go look it up. And you might not know it when I shuffle it. Okay, so hold on, hold on, hold on. Okay, let's shuffle. Oh, we can't get over you by Maze and Frankie Beverly. Go check that out. <laughs> okay, uh, let me get one more. So in Love With You by Leroy Hudson. Aww. Alright, Gemini's, hit that like, hit that subscribe, y'all. Thank you for watching. Peace out.